Hey guys, welcome back to another Titus Diorama and Action Figure Review. Uh, you may have noticed in my recent uh, reviews of the Gargoyle figures, this particular setup here. And I wanted to spend uh, just a couple of minutes talking about this setup and how you can create this at home yourself. So let's get to it. So this really is a pretty easy setup and the only thing that took really any time to um, work to uh, create is the stand here. I made this myself um, and it's made out of the uh, one inch thick um, foam board that you get in two by two uh, uh, squares. Uh, I just cut them down in order to make uh, this particular stand. I have a bunch of the stands that I've made. Uh, you can check that out on my YouTube. They sh I did a, um, a series of shorts that showed me putting these together. Um, basically, we've got uh, four uh, across, four inches across, one inch high, and we have three of those just layered in different ways there. And then a bigger one up here, I believe, if I remember right, it was a five by five that I did up here. Um, so it's really easy to make something like this yourself. You can do that if you want to um, attempt doing that. Check out my shorts and see how I did that. Uh, for the base and the background, um, the base, these were um, slate uh, tiles from my local uh, dollar store. Um, and they came in a really, really, really dark gray. Uh, you can kind of see the dark gray over this way. Uh, and when I came through with a uh, slate um, paint, acrylic paint, and just dry brushed it on here, just moving it around and just kind of getting a feel of what it would look like. Um, there's a lot of great texture in this, and I think that really brings this out um, for a, a great base piece. Um, this is actually from my local pet store, uh, and it's supposed to be um, for um, reptile cages, and it's supposed to be a slate wall or cliff. Um, so it's really easy to put this together. These cost me, I think, if I remember right, they were $4 a piece, so $8 for this. This, and this is the smaller one of the two versions you can get, you can get a, a much larger version of this. Um, this I think was like 25 or $30. Um, so really when you're looking uh, at the cost wise of making something like this, uh, I would probably say you're in about like the $40 range uh, with that. Uh, I know these are hard to find. They're usually uh, only in like Dollarama during the summer months uh, when people are gonna have, um, need them for their lawns and stuff. Um, this to make really, I mean, you buy the sheet of the foam board. I think it's like eight bucks, somewhere around there, uh, for the, um, the two foot by two foot by inch. And I mean, you can make a ton of these. Of course, there's the acrylic paint, um, that you would need and glue and stuff like that. So I'd say probably for like, 15, 20 bucks if you had to buy the paint and everything as well, you can make a bunch of these uh, very quickly. Uh, and this particular foam board was blue. Um, you can also get them in green and pink as well. Um, anyway guys, I hope that you like this little video here. Uh, I just wanted to quickly talk about this setup and how easy it is to make something like this or put something like this together um, to be able to do your own reviews or simply just to display your action figures on. Hey guys, as always, stay nerdy and make sure you like and subscribe for more content.